Breaking news. The presidents of the United States, Joe Biden, Donald Trump, and Barack Obama, have been officially convicted for the crimes committed during their presidential terms. An arrest warrant has been released on all three of them. Um, Donald boys, Trump sustaining the most penalties, having to serve a total of 1,043 years in jail. What? Due to the fact that Biden will be inside of a jail cell. Hey, 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 what do you mean that I'll be in a jail cell? This year, I didn't even do shit. You turn off the radio, bro. This is fake Hillary news, Clinton dumbasses. I ain't DeSantis. leaving the office for anything. They'll need to come and take me out of there. Well, good thing that I had the radio turned on. Now we know to not land the plane here, Omao. So where is our next stop, boys? We're going France with it or what? I don't know if we can go anywhere. There's two helicopters that have been following us ever since we got into the city. Wait, bro, what is that beeping sound? I don't know, sound? I'm out. See ya. Well, hopefully you guys got to see what that beeping sound was about. These fools really shot down the presidential plane. Wow, bro. That was like what? A couple of billion dollars or something. Anyways, that shit was old and needed to be refurbished. Can't believe these pricks are really after us. For now, I need to make sure I land safely. Whoever shoots my parachute, his mom is a hoe. Oh my, good thing I had the parachute ready. And as soon as I heard that the beeping wasn't stopping, I jumped right at the last second. Oh man, that was a close one. I don't know why you were still in the plane after Trump jumped. My ass got out as soon as I saw him taking a step out of the cockpit. Bro, that plane was one of my favorite things. How are we going to move around the planet now? Nah, this was overdoing. And whoever sent these cops after us is going to pay. Cops? Bro, this is the dang military mixed with the police and with the FBI. They really after us. What did we even do to deserve getting chased by the entire country's military force? Like, don't they have wars to attend to or something else? If they have so much free time, on their hands, why don't you deploy them Biden in the Middle East to retrieve some more oil? I don't know, but can somebody tell me since when arresting people was made using miniguns? There is a helicopter shooting 100 rounds per second at our car. I, I don't think they want to arrest us. It looks like they want to kill us, if anything. Don't you live in America, Joe? Arrest can turn deadly in an instant, sometimes for no reason at all. So don't be surprised. Do we have anything in plan? I can't think of how we can escape this. If we knew about this, we were better off fleeing the country for a while. Yeah, if we knew, but we didn't. Somebody planted this attack on us. And how could we leave the country like that? I can't just leave my family behind. We need to fight them. How exactly, I don't know for the moment, but don't worry, we'll get through this. Yeah, the thing is that I don't have a family anymore ever since I got into that argument with Michelle and we tried assassinating her. So I don't really care. I can be right now in North Korea. Nobody would miss me. Michelle, huh? Hold up, maybe you're onto something. Is that a fighter jet? Nah, bro, this is getting out of hand. I thought I sold those a couple of months ago or donated them to Ukraine. How the... Don't tell me those are Ukrainians that came into the United States to hunt us. Yo, nah, Trump, stop the car right now. I'm pulling out the obama minator on these pricks. Calm down, Biden. If you take a step out of this car, you will be evaporated in a blink. I think they're trying to let us run out of gas and then ambush us, so we need to find what to do before that happens. And by that, I mean in the next 30 minutes because we're running low on fuel. Come on, boys, think fast. I don't want our next stop to be dapping up Abraham Lincoln or being in the prison again. <laughs> Come on, dump all the bullets you have in them. Don't show any mercy, they wanted to kill us. This is what you get for trying to arrest the presidents. Trump, did you wake up? Are you with us? Come on, help us, bro, we're surrounded. Yeah, that's what I'm doing, can't you see? What even happened? How did the car explode all of a sudden? Last thing I remember is that I was just saying to not get out of it because we will get eviscerated. Then everything became blurry, and all of a sudden I wake up with the car as a fireball. Apparently those jets that Biden saw in the first place weren't so friendly. Maybe this is all the anger the military holds against us because Joe sold or donated it to foreign countries. Besides that, take a look, we're out numbered. We need some backup or otherwise let's surrender, bro. These suits can't go too much more against these high caliber bullets. Who do you even want to call for backup? We assassinated everybody who could have helped us. The ones who remain can't do anything other than smile and give a peace sign to the police. Well, there is someone that we didn't manage to assassinate who can help us. Then call him already, bro. What are you waiting? All right, that's it. He said he's on his way. Yo, Obama, I didn't know he still had feelings for you. I think that you should apologize. As soon as I said that I'm with you, he said that he would be here in a second. Bro, why are there earthquakes and what are you talking about? Who should I apologize to and who still has feelings for me? Who is you talking? No. No, don't tell me you called her, you idiot. What did you do? This was our last option. Would you rather be dead or have him save us? Who are you guys talking about? I still don't get it. All I hear is some Hulk noises and a lot of... Oh, it's... It's Michelle. Three, two, one. Boom! Bitch! Hello, boys. Don't worry, I came to the rescue. I'll try to get y'all out of here. Obama, how are you doing? I missed you. Uh, 
smash. You see, it was that easy. She even acknowledged that she misses you, Barack. Oh man, love is the most beautiful thing in the world, isn't it? Nah, bro, having Michelle on a speed dial is crazier than anything that happened today. Obama, what are your thoughts on the situation? I'm, I'm speechless. I mean, did she really say that? Man, I knew that I can always count on her. And don't misgender my glorious Queen Trump. Talk to her as a female, she's not a guy. All right, let's not get back to the old jokes, Obama. We all know who we're dealing with. There is nothing to hide. I mean, you literally have the Hulk going around and smashing cars into helicopters in Michelle form. I can hear you, Donald. You're still a piece of shit like you used to be, huh? Go and find an armored car, not that. I need something solid to give you three a piggyback ride. Piggyback ride, bro? Really? This is offensive at this point. I ain't no toddler. I'm a grown man, bro. Send her ass back. We don't need her help. And look at Obama. What are you doing, you fool? Get inside. Didn't you hear what he said? He's about to give us a piggyback ride. Where exactly, we don't know, but I guess that we're about to find out. Hopefully not to the jail. Hey, Michelle, do you still have any animosity toward us? Or are we cool again? Won't you shut up, Joe? Don't you see that I have to deal with 3,000 things at once? If you don't need my help, then why don't you get out of the car, dumbass? Stay here and have fun by yourself. Daddy Michelle is not looking out for you anymore. And about you two, stay here until I clean the area. But it seems like more units keep on coming. I don't know how long this will take. Boys, to be honest, things aren't looking too well. As Michelle said, more units keep on coming. I think we got to the point where even Russians joined our forces to take us down. It's getting ridiculous. And the only way out of this, by the way things are looking, is to surrender. Prison is no stranger to us. I mean, we've been there already and also escaped from it. So if we did it once, we can do it again. I thought Hulky Manchel was our way out, but things don't look that great. Oh man, not jail again. I bet there is a Tyrone in there waiting for us to drop the soap just because Biden didn't want to make it easy for them in there. Talking about jail, how is that lawsuit against you doing Trump? He lost it. We're about to pay $84 million to that bitch for no reason. He just got robbed. At least you know that I'm innocent as well, Joe. And do you think that this is the time to talk about it? We have greater things to worry about, like making sure one of those helicopters doesn't crash into us after Hulk Chell punches them in the air. Yeah, that's it. I'm, I'm surrendering. Hey, cops, that was it. We're done. Come and get us and put us in cuffs. Wait, no, what are you doing? Wait, are you serious? I thought that you were joking. Nah, there is no way we're doing this right now. Biden, just put your gun down, bro. That was it. Uh, hopefully we can at least get the same cell. This dirty place, man. I hate it. How can I survive in here if they don't have any ice cream? I asked all day long if they have it here. I even told one of the inmates that if he can get me some, I'll talk to a judge to shorten his sentence, but he choked me and said that if I'm in here, how can I help him? And I was like, dang it, he's right. You have to speak with authority to them, but because you're a well-known bitch, they will always make fun of you. With me instead, they fear me, for example. You see this group of thugs? I can beat one of them up right in front of them, and nobody will do anything about it because they know to not play with Donald Trump. I rule this place. So as long as you're with me, you're good. Now go to sleep already. How many stomps do you have? Hey, you three. Donald J. Trump, Barack Obama, and Joe Biden. Come here, I need to talk with you. Oh well, it seems that we'll have to fight a guard in our first day in here. Yeah, you heard it. Now go and pick up your homie and stop staring at me like that, you weirdo. Let's go and see what this snake wants from us. If he starts talking without respect, I'll put him in his place. Don't worry. And then they are going to put us in solitary confinement, locked up 24 seven without seeing daylight for the next month straight. So I'll say to chill out. Come on, guard, spit up fast what you got. Do you have something against the beating I gave that thug there? My hands ain't tired, buddy. Nah, I don't care about that. I hate them too. Listen, I got told on the radio that you guys have a visitor. He's at the communication booth. But due to the aggravated crimes you were charged with, you aren't allowed to touch him. You have one hour at your disposal to go there and greet them. Your visitors are limited to only three per month, so use them wisely. All right, all right. Take a deep breath and calm down. I know it's hard to believe that you're talking to me right now, but no need to be so nervous. Take care of those keys you got there. Boys, come on. Let's see what is this guy talking about. Well, well, well. So you really did surrender after all, huh? You didn't believe that I could save you three or what? Why did you call me in the first place if you even thought about surrendering? Just so you know, I think I destroyed half of the military personnel in the United States and I'm still walking freely. And I'm still locked up in a four by four cell, bitch. If you are so free, can't you bite this concrete with your jaw and turn it into dust so we can get out? I mean, do something. Why did you come here? Hey, Biden, chill out on how you talk to my wife, all right? To my what? Oh, so... So you still have feelings for me, Obamba? What? 
Um, no, I mean, yes, but no, actually, I don't know why I said that I'm sorry. I mean, I know, but whatever, forget about it. The question still stands. Why are you here? How cute and dumb you are at the same time. I obviously came here to save you. Why would you think I would be here otherwise? You know what? Before I do anything, I need either Joe or Trump to punch Obama for me. I um, missed you, my the, little queen. What did she Listen, say to punch this him? is the plan. Yo, I'm going to slide you I knew this you phone. married a weirdo, but Be not careful like this. so nobody sees um, you with just it. Act like I want it you hurt, to look at the clock <laughs> and at 8 p.m. to be outside in the yard before the call out begins. Okay, at 8 sharp, weird. I'll land in there and take you one by one to jump into the stratosphere and probably then land to a mountain where you three are going to what lay low this? for the oh, next the phone, couple of right. days, maybe weeks. Understood? You just have to make sure that at 8, you are outside in the yard. Yes, at 8, we're outside in the yard. Come on, Autobots, let's roll. I can't believe this shit. Hokina Michelina is about to save us. So, what's the time? These prisoners keep staring at me, and I don't like it. I want to get out of here as soon as possible. Jail ain't for me. Hopefully, they will let me back in the White House again, and hopefully, they didn't throw my wife out of there. Didn't you hear, Michelle? Before you get to the White House, we'll have to live in the mountains for some time. So you better prepare for that, because that is worse than living in prison, Brody. She should be here anytime soon. I mean, he, since her hoax side, will come. Bro, how many times do I have to tell you it's she and that's it? Keep it like that. I don't care if she's tapping into her masculine side, which you guys call the Hulk or whatever, where she gets these superpowers. She's still a queen. Yeah, so who's the queen in the relationship? I don't get it, because I think I heard her when we were talking calling you a queen as well. And here it is. Oh, man, I can already smell the freedom. Boys, can I go first? Glad to see you here. So the plan worked. Now I saw that there is a gym back there, and I was wondering, do you guys mind if I try to break my bench press PR real quick? I'm feeling strong today after throwing all those helicopters. What is wrong with you? 